Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lexi and today's video is my summer favorites. Nobody asked me for this. <laughs> I didn't even ask y'all if y'all wanted this video, but I was like, shit, I just felt like making this video. I'm like, I have some things that I've really, really been loving this summer and yeah, I'm just sharing it. It's a lot of like skincare, makeup items, and only one hair product because y'all know I trust me new all the time. So it is what it is with the hair product. So it's mainly like skincare, hygiene, makeup stuff, and let's just start. Let's just hop right in. Subscribe if you are new to my channel because who does favorites anymore? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm gonna do it right now. Okay, so. The first thing on my list <laughs> is this brush from IT Cosmetics, okay? This is the Heavenly Luxe French Boutique Blush Brush number four. Let me show you guys it up close and personal. It's dirty right now. I used it on today. <laughs> um, this brush is the softest freaking brush that I own. I don't really have expensive brushes. Most of my brushes are from Eco Tools, um, Morphe, um, BH Cosmetics. That's it. I don't really have. I don't have expensive brushes. So this was gifted to me when I did a sponsored video for Sephora and J C Penney, and I've been using it ever since that video. It's probably expensive. I never look at the price. So if you don't care about makeup like that, you don't need this brush at all. Like it's not needed. But if you like makeup brushes, if you have the money to splurge, this has become a favorite brush. I brought it with me to New Orleans. Like I bring it everywhere. Like it's just, oh my gosh. Oh, it's so soft. <laughs> I powder my face with it and I'm just always having the best time. <laughs> All right, next item. So the next item is actually a brow product. I love me a good brow pencil. I really only use brow pencils and then like a brow gel on top. That's really all I ever do to my brows. And Glossier came out with this brow flick situation. I seen it online, like I have to try it. Like it looks so good, I have to try it. It's like a felt tip marker, like it's so cool. <laughs> but it really makes your brows look naturally thick and not like drawn in, which I live. I, I live for that look. So this is what it looks like. This is the packaging right here. I hope you guys can see this. I'm not sure if you can. This is the tip of it. It's like a marker. A super super pointy felt tip marker you might think you have to put on a lot of it or like press down but it's literally like the smallest little flicks <laughs> of this thing will get your bra fave fave I'm using it ever since it came in the mail have not tried another brow pencil since I got this brow flick markery thing and I got the color brown. Next on my list is some sunscreen. Now this is the Unseen Sunscreen Broad Spectrum 40 from Supergoop. This is pricey. I was hurting to purchase this. But when it comes to sunscreens that don't make you oily, that have good ingredients, that are cruelty free, like it's a hard, it's a hard buy. It's a hard buy, like everybody loves the Olay stuff. I don't buy Olay stuff. It was hard for me to find a good sunscreen. I bought the Black Girl sunscreen, but that's great for the body. For my face, it was a little bit too greasy and it didn't work out for me. Like my acne and you know, it just was too much. Anyways, it goes on clear and it's not greasy. It's like, it's bomb. It's expensive, but it works. So, and I've, I've had it for like a month now. And I really have made a dent in it. So yeah, I guess it kind of is worth it. I don't know, child. I wear it every single day because to get rid of dark spots, you want to wear sunscreen. I wear it for my dark spots mainly. I don't really care about other stuff. <laughs> to be honest, I wear it to help me not get my dark spots darker because I already have enough of that happening when I have acne and it pops and then I get dark spots. So 
sunscreen is to aid with the clarity of my skin and maybe I care about sun rays if I'm being honest I'm I don't I don't I, I don't sorry next on my list is some lip gloss now this is another like luxury not luxury it's it's very small for the price so maybe it's luxury I don't know it's the Glossier lip gloss this is the best freaking lip gloss I've ever purchased and I bought it again well this was free <laughs> this one came to me for free I bought the next one that I just ordered in the mail it's in this room someplace this Glossier lip gloss first of all it stays on you forever second of all it's so thick thickety thickums okay and it's just oh it's glossy it's super glossy like it's really good it's 14 freaking dollars though so i just be like ugh. so i really only wear this when like i don't know going somewhere nice <laughs> if i'm not going anywhere nice i put on my nyx clear gloss that bad boy is bomb too so <laughs> like who is like I'm ridiculous I'm ridiculous next on my list is this Sol de Janeiro bum bum soul oil with SPF 30 sunscreen you guys let me shake it up let me shake it up <laughs> let me shake it up let me shake it up cuz it has some shimmer in here yes shimmer <laughs> This is what it looks like it's amazing it really does give you a nice glow honey Ugh, I live <laughs> I'm so annoying this is also kind of pricey everything today pretty much is pricey except for one thing or two things but yeah this is like my beach glow like I put on some um, black girl sunscreen to get me actually like you know glistening greasy looking and then I put on this bum bum soul oil I be gleaming so the next thing on my list is some deodorant because we have to stay not funky you know we have to be not not be funky it's summertime it's hot it's very very hot in Miami like horrible sun sunscreen Alexia deodorant so I don't want to bore y'all with the backstory but I've tried probably like 35 deodorants in my time because I use all natural deodorants right and for me and my armpit situation they'd wear off like not wear off but over time it, may, it could work for you on January right and then in March it could just clock out like it could be like you know what I quit I'm just not gonna work for you anymore so that happens to me on a regular basis I will try a new thing it could be trash and then if I'm off rip then I will like you know not use it anymore but it could be bomb keep me nice and dry keep me nice and fresh and then come two months three months four months I'm like did I put an order in today I did why I think because it stopped working and that happens to me all the time if you use natural deodorant let me know down below if that happens because it happens to me for the past like five years I've been having the same problem <laughs> so right now I'm on this one I have tried this in the past like three years ago and it worked and right now it's good it's working for me really really well um, no promises because these things love to just quit and walk home like really in the middle of the day like you know it's hot I'm done working for you. I'm gonna go home, put my feet up, and just chill. That's what happens to me all the time. So, but right now, me and Sport Urban Cowboy, okay, we are rocking. We are having a great time. We are funk free, okay? So, this can be bought at Whole Foods and online. I've tried so many deodorants so and most of them have been good some of them have been trash so you know like it's a whole thing right now this is the thing for me I actually was using this like maybe like two months ago and then I bought a new one just to try it out I love trying new deodorants <laughs> and it was not 
doing anything at all. I was like putting lotion under my freaking armpits. So then I went back to this one. I was like, oh, hey, old friend, I missed you. And in reality, I go to work, I go to the workout. So I need literally all day protection. I can't be out here with half the day. No, the funniest part is it's a man deodorant, but it works. <laughs> it does smell like a man. It smells like musky, which I love. Like I don't really care. But if you don't like that scent, if you want like a girl be flowery and like lavender or whatever, don't buy it. But see me, if it keep me smelling not funky, I'ma use it. So I'm using it and it's great. And I love a nice little musky scent, okay? <laughs> not musty, okay? Musky with a you know what I mean? Isn't this fun? <laughs> so the next thing is this CoverGirl True Blend Matte Made Foundation. Honey, this became a favorite when I went to New Orleans and I was like, hello, my makeup looks flawless and intact. And once I blot the sweat away, I'm back to being matte. <laughs> Well, it's so good. Let me zoom in for y'all. Zoom in. Let me put up for y'all. This is the color D50. It's my color right there. D50. I'm moving so much for no reason. Here I am again. I love it. I'm not wearing it right now because I don't want to waste it. <laughs> I, I put on makeup just to record. So I have on some um, black opal stick foundation it's good too but they don't control the oil like this baby do you want it like this so anyways i love this stuff i i love it i love this cheap first of all but it works like better than most of my higher price foundations like the iman foundation also is a really really good for staying matte but this <laughs> this one is better this one is better this one is better and like Fenty's great for that too but this is better it's better I'm sorry but I love it and I've been putting it on to last me throughout my days in this horribly hot place that I live in so I'm feeling a little bit oily and just pat this you know I've had this face on all day so forgive me I mean just <laughs> touch up a bit you know <laughs> okay <laughs> last product oh gave me a sneak peek <laughs> melanin hair care ASMR baby <laughs> what do you do baby listen you okay brush okay this melanin hair care cream I like am so mad at myself for ever doubting my good sis because in reality this has come in so clutch for me when I needed her and the good thing about my good sis is that she goes with anything at this point whatever leave-in I pair my good sis with whatever gel I pair my good sis with, I have zero, I'm coming close right here, zero problems, okay, zero. I love it. I know if my hair is crusty, dusty, and a little bit musty, <laughs> I am on 10. I can count on my good sis to just bring it all back, bring it all back together. And I just fallen in love with this all over again. There it is right there. Melanin Hair Care Twist Elongating Cream. I've mentioned this in a couple videos since I ever tried it out. I mentioned it in a favorites for stylers, but for the heat, 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 and the dry, dry, dry that I'm living in right now. <laughs> That's better. This clutch, clutch, okay? Um, the video's done, video's over. I did all of my favorites, skincare, a little bit of hair care, some makeup, 
y'all get it y'all get it y'all get it okay um love you guys if you have any requests because right now i'm a little bit dry <coughs> dry when it comes to video ideas i'm bored so if you have any requests any ideas feel free to enlighten me bars because i need help i don't know what to film i want to film i really do but i don't have all the equipment to do so but i don't have any ideas so help me help me because i don't want to stop making videos i'm just like i'm like what the hell do i want to film y'all ask for makeup so i'll be doing more makeup you better watch it <coughs> sorry i'm dry but comment down below give me some ideas dm me some ideas i want to start doing like some like chit chat ready with me's every single month being real with y'all giving me all my opinion on hot topics on whatever's going on in the world i want to just be a little more personal on here um not too personal but you know a little more personal so just talk to me because i need ideas Anyways, thank you guys for watching today's video. Hope that you, I'm actually really happy right now. <laughs> I don't know why. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I think it was fun just to have no purpose other than to tell y'all what I've been loving this season. And yeah, maybe I'll do like seasonal favorites, but I feel like I have to actually have favorites. Like right now, these are my favorites, but like I don't always have favorites, you know? Like I can't, I can't guarantee I'm gonna have one every season, but Maybe I will. Maybe I'll make an effort to put together some favorites more often. We'll see what I come up with. I'm just doing a lot of moving and shaking and all kinds of, you know, what am I doing with my body? I'll see you guys later. I actually have one more thing. It's a song right now. It's my song. <laughs> like, I love this song. So this song is off of DJ Mustard's mixtape album whatever his project i never know if it's a mixtape or album or pro i don't know so it's a project and it's called <laughs> baguettes in the face okay like baguette diamonds it's a bop okay <laughs> i can't play too much because of copyright but let's just see what we can play. Okay, narcos. I make sure they're easy, but they don't know what it takes. I don't want no nigga. I don't want no Don't ask me the time I got baguettes in the face. That's my song this summer. That's my summer jam. I'm going to go now. I've been here for way too long. So I'm going to go. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. See y'all in the next video. Peace. Quality content, baby. <laughs> Where's the off button? <laughs>